I haven't filmed a video in so long. I've just been looking at boxes, the kitchen, my bedroom, like all the important rooms in the house. Like that's where I've been spending a lot of my time. So it's just fun to be like in my beauty space and to do a beauty video with you guys. All right, so the first thing I'm going to do is moisturize my hands and my cuticles because I've already used a couple of nail tools that I have and <clears throat> I've shortened my nails, cut my cuticles. I'll be using the Body Shop Oils of Life Intensely Revitalizing Facial Oil. I, I think I got too much. I used this on my face during a vlog that I did um, for my moving and I loved it so much on my face it just felt so good I decided to put the excess on my hands you guys wow this oil feels so good on the face the next morning when you wake up your face feels so soft and this is the blossom cuticle oil the rose one so I'm basically just gonna dab a little bit in the center of each cuticle I'm not going to re-wet the wand because there's a ton of oil on the wand and so I'm going to just rub that in so now that I have moisturized my hands and my cuticles I'm ready to move on to my nails finally I don't usually start with a base coat I just don't prefer it because usually the color is going to be off within like four or five days anyway or I'll change the color in this video I am choosing between colors so let's get to the fun part so obviously for Halloween and for candy corn I've got the color orange so this is the Sally Hansen extreme wear sun-kissed color this probably would have looked really really good in the summer so I have that color to choose from. I also have, inspired by Candy Corn, is a yellow color. This is also the Sally Hansen Extreme Wear, but this color is called Mellow Yellow. So I've got my Candy Corn inspired colors here and I'm super, super excited to try something with these colors, but I also wanted to throw in like wild card colors. So I also have this sparkly brown color by Sally Hansen this is the miracle gel this is called spice age I think brown is pretty cute it's a pretty trendy color these days I also wanted to throw in an Essie color called I believe it's called blank let me know in the comments down below what you think about this combination of colors we already went Halloween candy shopping I have been eating a lot of Hershey's. I've been eating Hershey's milk chocolate, and I've also been eating a lot of Twix. I love this. The caramel is like perfect. I need to put all of these away. I need them away from me. So let's decide. I'm gonna put my rings back on. I'm definitely gonna do orange right so why don't we start with orange I'm just gonna open it up and see how inspired I get so let's go ahead and set these aside let's do it like this so I'm taking the orange color first okay let's go ahead and do my right hand first do I dare now I'm right-handed so let's see uh, okay Okay, I'm gonna start with my index finger. Oh my goodness. I can't believe I'm painting orange nails. What? Who am I? I think this color probably would have done really well to wear just in the summer because obviously like, when I think of the sun, I think of yellow, but I also think of orange. I'm kind of inspired just to do the middle finger too. Oh my gosh, what is going on? orange nails what am I gonna wear oh I have all these options am I gonna use them all I wonder what is gonna happen when I think of orange I also think of like Thanksgiving like Thanksgiving is coming up I think orange is gonna be super super cute for that like obviously orange is just a fall color right oh it's cute in my little mirror down here 
Orange looks amazing. Why didn't I do this this summer? Oh my goodness. I should have done this this summer. I like didn't go out that much. Like I think, did I even go to the beach? I don't think I went to the beach, which is like pretty sad. And I live in Los Angeles and where I moved to, I'm still the same distance from the beach. Like I should have gone, but this would have been so pretty. Like with a tan. Oh, why didn't I do it? Like, ooh. I was like, oh, if I put a yellow dot here, would that be cute? Okay, I'm gonna do my pinky. I'm gonna do my pinky. I'm gonna do it, I promise. It's about to drip anyway if I don't do it. Oh gosh. Okay, so I'm gonna do my pinky. And the trick with painting my nails is start painting my right hand first, honestly, because if I'm successful at doing my right hand, was I gonna do a second coat? What was I about to do? Maybe I'll go back. If I'm successful at doing my right hand, then like my left hand is usually a breeze. This is already experimental for me. <laughs> I'm used to having red. Okay, I'm gonna do, should I do brown? Or maybe I'll wait until like after or closer to Thanksgiving to like try brown with something. So I'm gonna do white. What am I about to do with this white? Oh God, I just hope I don't mess up my nails. Why didn't I open these before? What in the world? Okay, and I put all that like oil on my nails. What was I thinking? What was I thinking? Okay, here, let's move these have this up here okay I know what I'm gonna do I'm gonna paint my thumbnail white Oh my gosh, how'd that, how'd I do that? Oh my gosh, am I gonna like this? Boy, I just went for it. Oh my gosh, this is definitely a Halloween look. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is definitely a Halloween look, especially if I leave it like this. I'm not gonna leave it like that, okay. I'm just gonna do the same thing on the other hand. Okay, so let me tell you the trick to painting your own nails if you want it to look as good as possible first time around. The trick for painting my nails is to not get too close to the edges from the beginning. Just like start in the center and go towards the outside. And even if you have a little bit of space left right here, that is fine. Um, most of the time after one or two days of wearing nail polish anyway, that space will be there because your nail will grow out. And so it's fine if it's like that day one. <coughs> I need water. And I didn't bring any in here. <gasps> Do you guys see this? I was so confident that I was doing this correctly too. I really, really, really was. I got sidetracked guys. I was talking about going to Sephora and doing a foundation wear test on the NARS Soft Matte Foundation. I guess I just got carried away. Oh, look what happened. I didn't want them to be different. I wanted them to be the same. Oh my goodness. Now I've got to make these two white and I was chit-chatting about being at Sephora, you guys. Well, now that I know these are gonna be white, I mean, I guess it'll be fine for me to talk to you about something else. Um, yeah, so those are the foundation wear tests that are gonna be coming up. I'm so excited about those. Obviously, they don't have anything to do with Halloween, so I don't think they're gonna be coming out before Halloween, but then I have the rest of the year to do them. Even though there's a million videos on both of those products out already, I'm starting my second layer. All right, so iOS 14. Let me know if you like it in the comments down below. There's a few videos on it. Um, 
I have a giveaway that is going on on my vlog channel, you guys. You want to enter this giveaway because it's international. Anybody can enter the giveaway. I'm going to link my vlog channel down below. I think I probably already said that in this video that I was going to do that. Um, yeah, so the Lily Lashes are in the giveaway and then also there is a, there's no more yellow, don't make that mistake, that would be a really bad mistake. Um, there is a, what else is in there, there's a Target gift card in the giveaway, so that's pretty awesome. And yeah, you can use the gift cards online, you can use them in store. Alright, I'm not going to wait that long to do the top coat. Um, because this is also like the good to go top coat by Essie, which means you put it on and I think your nails dry faster. But I do love that you don't have to be perfect and precise. You guys, I'm so hungry. It's way past dinner time and I want to go eat dinner. So you guys, these are my nails. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. Don't forget to hop on over to my vlog channel, enter the giveaway. In each of the videos that's up there on the vlog channel, the giveaway is explained. So it's super, super simple, you guys. It's at the beginning of every video. Thank you guys for watching. I love you so much. Bye.